All right, at Chris, 34 degrees in Conway, where they're gearing up for homecoming. 43 in North Myrtle this morning, 42 in Myrtle Beach. It's going to be another beautiful sunrise as we go into uh, this next hour or two. Temperature wise, yeah, we're cool this morning. Jacket's going to be needed at least through lunchtime. The wind is dying down, which is good news for the afternoon as temperatures will climb into the upper 60s. High pressure to our northwest. Now that brings in that northerly wind. A few fair weather clouds tomorrow, but plenty of sunshine for your Sunday. And you'll already notice not a drop of rain in that forecast for the weekend. 68 today for the beaches, 72 for your Saturday, 74 by the time we head towards Sunday. And even inland, we're looking at those temperatures low to mid 70s. It's going to be a nice one for those afternoons. But keep in mind, if you're heading out early for weekend events, yeah, you're still going to want the jacket, whether that's the ball golf, whether that's heading up to Conway, the homecoming and Halloween golf cart parade taking place 930 there in the morning. Of course, for those that are in the parade, you have to be there earlier. Yeah, going to be a little bit cooler. You'll notice by nine we're sitting at 55 and then by 10 o'clock starting to turn a little bit more comfortable. That will lead us into game time. Once again, nationally televised game with the Rage of Cajun taking on the Chanticleers. Kickoff is noon, 65 degrees by the end of the game. Yeah, we're sitting in the lower 70s. Should be a pleasant one, but there's so much more than just what's happening in Conway. For a look at all the other events, let's go over to Jenna this morning. Yeah, Andrew, so many different things to take part in this weekend. If you're not heading out to Coastal Carolina, maybe you're heading to the Loris Bog Off. Temperatures going to climb throughout the morning. Like Andrew said, you may just want that lighter jacket for the first start of the morning. But then as we head into the afternoon, temperatures are going to climb to the low 60s by around 3 o'clock. And then we'll climb to the upper 60s later on in the afternoon. The Myrtle Beach Kite Festival also happening this weekend. Just a really nice weekend to get outside and to enjoy the forecast. And as we head into this weekend and the start of next week, we're going to continue to slowly see those temperatures climb. Even overnight low temperatures going to start to climb. But notice as we head into the start of next week, we'll be back to that mid 70 range upper 70s by the ending of the week. And for rain, there's no rain in the forecast. We haven't seen rain in 22 days. And that rain-free streak is going to continue even as we head into this weekend, a nice rain-free weekend. Then as we head into the start of next week and throughout the next 10 days, no rain in the forecast. And we are seeing some of that normally dry areas on that drought monitor that came out yesterday for some of our inland locations. Now you may notice that our flower, some of your flower beds may just be a little dry the grass a little bit drier and over the next 10 days with no rain in the forecast you can expect this to continue.